and then went on to discharge her duties as a psychiatrist. At the same location, Harley meets a man named Joker, who has become her close buddy. Harley used to agree with Joker on every point. That Joker invites her to jump into a chemical liquid, which causes Harley's mind to be severely damaged, and Black Mask, the city scoundrel, is shown with it. And he makes contact with the city's bad people in order to establish himself as an organized form of criminal, allowing him to engage in wrongdoings and taunt the citizens. He also has a habit of collecting masks. The next figure was Helena, who came from an aristocratic family. Her family had been slaughtered by some murderers in the pursuit of fortune, but she had survived at the time. One of the men drives her there, where one of the man's siblings meticulously trains her. As a result, she will be able to deal with evil people. After that, the movie begins, and Harley Quinn, who was left by Joker, appears. She was quite concerned about it and had also decided to have a pet with it, so she goes to a shelter and adopts a dog. It is also revealed here that Harley is a top skate fighter. Now Harley walks to a club owned by Black Mask, and she consumes a large amount of alcohol before entering the club, where her drink is spilt on a man. Who is it that constantly yells at her? At the same time, Harley leaps over him, breaking both of his legs. That man was none other than Black Mask's driver. Now that Black Mask is enraged by this behavior, he requests that Harley leave the club when she returns home from the club. Then she became enraged while watching Black Mask. Now Harley has made up her mind that she willfully destroy Black Mask, and she starts a truck and drives inside the chemical facility. And it was the same chemical plant where Harley had transformed into Joker, and the factory's owner was Black Mask, not anybody else. Now Harley leaps from the truck, which is then driven straight into the chemical facility, resulting in a massive explosion. And that factory has been completely demolished. Harley then walks away from the scene. When she awoke early in the morning, she had a strong need to eat. She then makes her way to a restaurant. She places an order for a sandwich there. She was now headed outside, sandwich in hand. Meanwhile, a cop named Renee Montoya starts chasing her down. And she hoped to be promoted after capturing Harley. Now, the Renee officer was not the only one here looking for Harley. There are a lot of Harley chasers. Because Harley had suffered a setback by meeting with Joker, everyone now knew that Joker was not with Harley, and they all had to pursue Harley. They are now all attempting to aggravate Harley one by one. Harley was now trapped between two fires. A masked girl appears around the same time. She then kills him with her crossbow. Who was it who sought to take out Harley? On the other hand, Black Mask, who abducted a family, may be seen. Black Mask wanted to learn more about a diamond from them. Now Black Mask commands his special attendants to murder that family, and Black Mask send a man to that small girl. The whole truth is revealed to them by that small kid. She assures Black Mask that the package would arrive in a few days and that a diamond will be included. And all of the codes for their account numbers had been engraved into that diamond. The family scene at the beginning of the film is still being discussed. Collecting all information, Black Mask also murders that girl. To Black Mask a driver was now required. Because Harley Quinn had broken his driver's legs. As a result, he hires Black Canary as his driver. Now he tells Black Canary and his men that delivery will be made tonight, that there will be a diamond, and that the diamond will contain several coats. I'll pay you a lot of money if you deliver that diamond to me safely, and you must not make any mistakes in this assignment. Go right ahead and deliver that diamond to me. Following that, they both proceed to take the diamond. When they return, a small girl named Cassandra begins to follow them, stealing diamonds, and she steals the diamond from Black Mask secretly. The police arrive shortly after that. They had all this information that a little girl named Cassandra robbed the place and stole the people's bags, chains, and jewelry. As a result, when the police arrive, they apprehend Cassandra and arrest her. The scene then shifts and it is shown that Harley Quinn has been kidnapped by the men of Black Mask. And Black Mask threatens Harley Quinn with killing her here, claiming that you have had no communication with the Joker. It has been displayed all across the city. And after you've caused me a big loss, Harley informs Black Mask that you sought to take a diamond that had been stolen by a young girl. If you create that diamond's access to me, then I'll let you go. Says Black Mask to Harley. 
and my guys will never again tease you. And Black Mask tells her, if you don't succeed in completing your duty, then my men will put an end to you. Harley is shown in a prison cell in the next scene, where Cassandra was held captive. And she starts firing her rifle there. There were several eggs and a variety of colors in Harley's gun, and Harley used to scare the attacker away from her gun when he approached her. Harley now arrives at Cassandra's prison cell, where she is confronted by all of the cops. When she arrives, she discovers that all of the prison cells are locked. And Harley throws the security system into disarray, unlocking all of the prisoner's cells, including Cassandra's, and releasing them all. All of the inmates now wanted to kill Harley. Because Harley, coupled with Joker, had dealt them a major defeat, and Harley fights everyone here. And the battle continues in the investigating department's region. There are numerous guns and weapons in this section, which were taken by the police from these detainees. And Harley gets her favorite weapon, a baseball bat, from here, and starts fighting with all of the inmates. It is revealed here that Harley fights with a baseball bat and skates. Finally, after fighting with everyone, Harley escapes with Cassandra. Later, Harley discovers that Cassandra has absorbed the diamond. After that, Harley arrives at a restaurant and picks up Cassandra. And the restaurant's proprietor was well versed in the city scoundrels. On the second floor of that restaurant, there is also a Harley residence, about which no one knows anything. Following that, Harley feeds her pet. Some others reached her residence on the same night, and those people threw an explosive on her house. As a result, her pet is no longer alive. Now Harley becomes enraged over the loss, believing that only the owner of this eatery was aware of her residence. How did these people find out my home's address? Coming downstairs, Harley confronts the owner of this eatery, why did you divulge the location of my residence to them? The restaurant owner then adds, it's simply a business. They had given me a large sum of money. And I'm intending to open a bigger restaurant than it, which is why I told them your address. So I had no choice but to do it. Now that owner has gone away and said it. Now Harley chooses to hand over Cassandra to Black Mask, putting an end to all of the scoundrels pursuit of her. After that, Harley phones Black Mask and instructs him to come to her address, where she informs him that she would hand over Cassandra to him. Our agreement will be formalized after that. It wasn't just any site, it was Joker's favorite spot, where he used to carry out his nefarious schemes. On the other hand, an officer named Rene Montoya who works for her police department is displayed. There, his senior deceives her. Renee's boss had promoted his other assistant, despite the fact that Renee earned the promotion because she had done admirably. And she'd arrested and imprisoned a slew of crooks. Now Renee was depressed about it. When Harley Quinn called Black Mask, he asked Black Canary and his buddy to pursue her, she resigned from the police department. And he tells them that if they bring that gem to me, they can kill Harley. It was also heard by Black Canary, who did not want Black Mask's man to kill Cassandra because she knew her. As a result, Black Canary delivers a message to them both. Now that the buddy of Black Mask has all of the information, he tells him everything and addresses him as Black Mask. Now that Black Mask is enraged, he reveals his true identity. Black Mask is now preparing to fight everyone, and the scene shifts to Harley, who was previously with Cassandra. Now Harley is attempting to reclaim the diamond from Cassandra, which has been devoured by her. Then Renee and the Black Masked Girl arrive, and Black Canary arrives as two. When they all see each other there. They then proceed to assault one another, believing that they are all implacable enemies. They are still discussing how Black Mask and his entire group are approaching them. At the same time, they believe that if Cassandra is not rescued, Black Mask will kill her. And he isn't a good man if he spares our lives after murdering Cassandra. As a result, we will all have to battle Black Mask together, and as a result, the entire squad will form a bond. The name of this team is Birds of Prey. Then Harley tells her that they have a lot of weapons, but when she unlocks the cupboard, she finds nothing. This reveals to her that Joker has taken all of the weapons from here. Meanwhile, Renee finds a package containing a variety of weaponry, including bulletproof jackets and baseball bats. It is used by all of them. Finally, the Birds of Prey squad prepares to meet the Black Masks. The men of Black Mask enter and begin searching for Cassandra, 
because Cassandra possessed the diamond carrying all information about that wealthy family. Now the Birds of Prey squad is fighting with everyone skillfully, and they are eventually leaving after fighting with them. At the same time, Black Mask comes in front of them, with a large number of guns. While the Birds of Prey squad was unarmed at the time, they now believe they are disarmed and that we cannot fight Black Mask. Meanwhile, they see Black Canary, a woman with superhuman communication abilities. Because of her voice, everyone gives way and they travel far. But Black Mask flees, squeezing Cassandra into his car in the process. And while skating, Harley begins to pursue their car, but her skating speed was not fast enough to keep up with them. Then that masked girl appears and Harley pursues their automobile. Harley now moves upside down in the car, using her brain, and breaks the car, causing it to come to a halt. Black Mask was also astute, and he hide behind the pillars, where there was deep darkness and mist, preventing Harley from seeing Black Mask. There were numerous statues to be found. But Black Mask also has Cassandra, and he threatens Harley there, saying that if she approaches him, he would kill her. However, Harley was also astute. She approaches him and attempts to shoot him with her gun, but her intended target, Black Mask, is missed. Her revolver had only one round left in it. And here's what Harley says to Black Mask, pardon me, but save the life of Cassandra. At the same time, Cassandra exclaims, pardon me. Because I've taken your ring as well. However, it is not a ring. It was a bomb pin that Cassandra had extracted from a device kept in Black Mask's jacket. Harley then pulls Cassandra towards her, and she uses it to shove Black Mask off the bridge. And Black Mask flies through the air. And he's fallen into the sea, signaling the end of the conflict. After that, the Birds of Prey team is formed. Then they're all seen eating in a restaurant, and Cassandra exclaims to everyone, I need to go to the restroom. I also require Harley. And while everyone is engrossed in their meal, it is revealed that Cassandra and Harley have escaped with a diamond. At the conclusion of the film, Harley reveals that Black Canary, Renee, and Black Masked Girl have reunited, and that the knowledge gained from the diamond has been given to the true heiress of that family, Helena. They had amassed so much money that they decided to keep the squad birds of prey. On the other hand, they had all three formed a unit to combat the scoundrels. She now sells the diamond from which Harley Quinn had gathered all of the information to a jeweler, netting a large